Hi, in this video I want to show you how to make a Windows Forms application uh, so you can uh, show a message box. Let's get started with this project. Okay, what are we going to do in this project? We're going to make a form. Oh, we this is the form and the user can click on this button the button can have some text in it or uh, you know uh, anything and when you click on the button a little dialog box will appear with the message with the match with a message and the sound and some sound so um, when you click on the button this will open up and when you open and when that opens up it will play a sound or something it doesn't need sound but you know it's cool so let's get started with that okay what you want to do first is download and install Microsoft Visual Studio it doesn't have to be ultimate it can also be Express Edition or um, anything else just make sure you have um, one version of Visual Studio and I recommend using Visual Studio uh, 2012 Express Edition at least. You don't need to do that. But I uh, recommend that. Here we have, um, uh, if you click on New Project, this box will show up, this dialog. And you click on Windows Forms application and give it the name you want. This is the tutorials. And then, um, once it's um, making um, the project, you ha have to uh, be patient. It doesn't take too long, but um, uh, when you have a slow computer, it will take some time. It's it's not that long uh, with me because I have an SSD built in my computer. Okay, when your uh, when your uh, application uh, is uh, open, your editor you will see this form form 1 um, don't close this be sure to uh, not delete it except for uh, if you want to uh, have another form or if you are pro and you want to uh, do your own things um, first what we want to do is place the button that's the latch for showing up the dialog box this is bottom 1 it's called bottom 1 um, if you want to, I'm gonna do it. You can uh, change the text of bottom one. Um, this is name, and this is not. Look, this one is not um, bottom one as here, as described here. You have to go to appearance and then click on text because name will uh, change the name. So in the code, you, uh, it will be instead of bottom one, it will be uh, something else. But um, if you want some more text, it uh, is not valid. So we're not going to touch that. We are going to touch text, and we're going to type something. Click here to show my first bra gram. And look at that, it changed. And when you click on bottom one two times. It will load some uh, time and this will pop up and this is the where the coding starts please um, don't delete this because um, end sub is uh, okay if you delete the private sub but end public class and end class don't delete those ones because that's um, where the code line starts so what do we what we want to do first is handles bottom one click this is um, when you click button one and then it will start doing something so let's uh, get started with the code um, button one is um, uh, is referred to this button and uh, dot and underscore click um, handles button one dot click is uh, the event we are gonna use so what do we wanna do to uh, pop up a dialog box or not a dialog box but a message box 
um, you want to click here and then type msg box um, bracket open two times this one and then this now uh, what will happen um, if you type something here like um, YOLO and then click on start this will happen it will build that's normal um, uh, it will take some while look here's form 1 and then we click on oh <laughs> I made I made I made uh, an error look YOLO it will open and you can um, make it uh, different with some sounds or uh, some themes like um, they need a comma and then um, you can type something else like YOLO and you need to type a comma after this uh, sign then you click on uh, MS then you type MSG box style box style and then you can abort or try ignore or something else I'm gonna do a, a critical just because it looks cool and you can even do this and then you can do the title like this um, YOLO says I think this will work um, it will build and if, if there are some errors I will help you out in the comments and it will give YOLO says YOLO with an error uh, critical stop and uh, that's the basic now now I'm gonna show you and this some this uh, some more difficult I'm gonna show you how to type uh, the code for the sound okay if you're satisfied with your code you can now leave this video but if you want something else like um, you want uh, audio then uh, stay tuned for a little while I will show you it now what you want to do be very secure with my um, exp explanation my dot computer this will give the command to um, do something uh, with the computer dot play dot oh, dot audio not dot play dot audio dot play system sound and then bracket open and then media media dot system sounds asterisk or one of the others nothing else I'm gonna show you custom sounds in another video but I'm gonna choose um, hand for now and then click enter close bracket and your code is complete but if you want to hear your sound and that's very important if you have this code you need to remove one part I'll show you that. Um, you need to remove this part. Okay, so you need to remove this. This whole part can be removed, and then um, it won't give you the theme, but it will give you the sound you ha had. In the theme, there are sounds, so it won't help you if you have two of them because it will overlap them um, this mm, is the full code for um, the video I'll show uh, and I'll uh, build it one once more okay I modified the code because it will give an error with this it gave an error to me but I and, and I didn't like errors so let's build it for one more time see if it works click here to show sometimes it will give an error like this I knew this will happen so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna click this I'm gonna delete yellow says the whole YOLO says because that's what gave us the trouble uh, and then continue it will give YOLO 
without the YOLO says just says tutorials you can modify it if you want I will give the code uh, for that um, if you want to and um, that pretty much wraps it up for this video and um, have fun with the programming see you next time bye from PC guys 1241